Improve your learning. First, reflections and concepts. First question: How can you explain the sound has energy? Answer: Sound has energy. Take a plastic bottle and a cell phone. Cut the top of the bottle so that it looks like a glass. Play songs on the mobile phone. in high volume and place it in the bottle close the mouth of the bottle with a balloon using rubber band so that it covers the bottle as shown in the figure and stretch it tightly so as to behave like a diaphragm see the picture here okay place some sugar crystals or small sand particles on the balloon diaphragm and observe the movement of particles do the same activity after removing the phone from the bottle okay next second one write the unit to measure the sound intensity answer decibel is the unit for measuring the in intensity of sound it is denoted as db third one write the difference between the noise and music answer so divide into two parts noise and music first we'll see noise sounds which are not pleasant to hear are called noise sounds which are pleasant to hear are called music noise is an irregular combination of sounds music is a combination of sounds which are produced in order it is unpleasant to hear it is pleasant to hear okay now fourth one explain the sources which produce sound pollution in your surroundings answer sources of sounds that are produced to sound pollution first sounds in traffic second sounds by motor vehicles third sounds in construction sites fourth sounds in industries fifth sounds in mines sixth sources of sound pollution like mixer grinder washing machines and motors etc okay next application of concepts first one the sounds of crickets that is insects make us close our eyes why answer as the pitch of the voices of insects are more than that of a man we are unable to bear the sound created by crickets insects okay second one write the names of any three musical instruments that you know explain how do they produce sound answer flute tabla and guitar okay this one you can write your own instruments means whichever you know you can write those instruments and you can explain it here i'm taking these three okay flute tabla and guitar flute the holes on it are closed and opened to change the wavelength and frequencies so that it blows good music tabla the membrane when vibrated by beating produce music it is a drum instrument guitar it has strings when they are vibrated the fringes produce music okay next one third one draw the figures depicting low amplitude and high amplitude answer low amplitude okay flute and sitar okay and high amplitude drum kit guitar trumpet so you need to draw these figures okay next one vibrations in a body produce sounds how do you prove it okay 
आंसर ए टू प्रूव वाइब्रेशंस इन अ बॉडी प्रोड्यूस साउंड्स मटेरियल रिक्वायर्ड हैक्सॉ ब्लेड अ ब्रिक अ टेबल प्रोसीजर टेक हैक्सॉ ब्लेड ब्लेड एंड कीप इट ऑन अ टेबल ओके हियर यू कैन सी इन द फिगर ओके दिस इज द हैक्सॉ ब्लेड इट इज केप्ट ऑन द टेबल Keep a brick on the hacksaw blade. Okay, brick is placed. Now press the other end of the hacksaw blade. It starts vibrating. Observation: We hear the vibrating sound of the blade. Result: The vibrations of a body produce sound. Okay. So the next one, higher order thinking questions. First one. What is the effect of humidity on equal on quality of sound propagation? Is there any difference in propagation of sound in air during the summer and winter seasons? Discuss. Answer: With increase in humidity, density of air decreases. So, with rise in humidity, velocity of sound increases. This is why sound travels in humid air. rainy season or winter than in dry air summer at the same temperature next one how does sound pollution affect biodiversity explain effects of sound pollution loss of hearing is the first effect it leads to sleeplessness hypertension increase in blood pressure etc next multiple choice questions first one an object which moves to and fro motion from rest known as linear motion vibration simple motion angular motion it is called to and fro motion is nothing but vibration okay second one The number of vibrations produced per second is known as frequency, shrillness, vibration limit, decibels. Number of vibrations produced per second is called as frequency. Okay. The audible sound range of man is ten to ten thousand vibrations per second, twenty to twenty thousand vibrations per second. Thirty to thirty thousand vibrations per second, or forty to forty thousand vibrations per second. Answer is B. Twenty to twenty thousand vibrations per second. Next fourth one, the oval window has a surface area dash of the eardrum. One by ten, one by twenty, one by thirty, one by forty. Answer is B. One by twenty-eight of the eardrum. The shrillness of a sound is known as pitch, vibration, intensity, decibel. Answer is A. That is pitch. Okay. So the next one, experiments. First one. conduct an experiment to know the relationship between the intensity of sound produced by a body and its amplitude answer first write a to know the relation between the intensity of sound produced by a body and its amplitude materials required wooden table 30 cm metal scale or nearly 30 cm hacksaw blade and a brick procedure place the blades or scale on the table with 10 cm of the blade on the surface of the table and rest of it in air keep a heavy brick on one end of the 10 cm blade or scale kept on table okay here you can see in the figure okay this is the scale or blade whatever you will take that is place here and on that brick is placed okay vibrate the blade gently and observe the 
vibrations and simultaneously listen to the sounds. Repeat the same 2-3 times and record observations in the table shown below. Okay, slowly you have to vibrate this. Okay, gently vibrate this and listen to the sound it produced. Okay, repeat this 2-3 times and you have to note down in the tabular form. Okay. Vibrate the blade using greater force. Observe the vibrations and listen to the sound. Repeat this for 2-3 times and record observations in the table shown below. Okay, first you have to do gently and then later with force. Okay, with greater force you have to vibrate it. And you have to note the observations. Okay, force, small, large. Vibrations of the blade, 50, 50. Intensity of sound, less and more. If the force is more, the intensity of the sound will be more okay when we applied large force we heard a loud sound when we applied less force we heard a feeble sound during loud sound the amplitude is more and for feeble sound the amplitude is less so intensity of sound increases with amplitude hmm? okay Next one, conduct an experiment to identi identify pitch or shrillness of different sounds. Answer, first write down aim, identify, identifying pitch or shrillness of different sounds. Materials required, a wooden table, two hacks or blades or metal scales of 30 cm length and a brick. Procedure. Place the first blade or scale on the table with 10 cm portion of the blade on the table and rest of it in air. Keep the brick as weight on 10 cm portion of the blade or scale kept on table. See the same procedure as previous till here. Okay? Next, place the second blade or scale on the table. See that the gap between these two blades is 10 cm. 25 centimeters on the table and 5 centimeters in air. Keep brick as weight on the scale of blade. Vibrate both blades with the same forces. Observe the vibrations and listen to the sounds produced. Repeat the same 2-3 times and record observations in the table shown. Okay, so you have to place one scale. So more of the scale is in air and the other scale less part is in the air. Okay, and you have to vibrate it and you have to observe and Note down the observations. Blade 1, 20 cm, 50 vibrations, less shrillness. Blade 2, 5 cm, 90 vibrations, more shrillness. Okay. What difference do you notice in number of vibrations of two blades? The number of vibrations in 5 cm blade is more. What difference do you notice in the quality of sound produced by them? The sound produced by the 5 cm blade is more shrill when compared to that of the 20 centimeter blade okay next uh, this is the project works collect photographs showing various situations of sound pollution and prepare a report so you have to collect the uh, photographs of sound pollution okay different type of sound pollutions and you have to write a report okay so let's take the pictures heavy traffic Okay, heavy traffic, marriage functions in which horns and speakers are used, Diwali celebration with lightning crackers. Report In our surroundings, there are many sounds causing sound pollution, like sounds of traffic, vehicle horns, sounds in construction sites, sounds in industries, sounds at mines, sounds during explo explosions, and bursting crackers, etc. The unwanted sound in our surroundings leads to sound pollution. There are some more sources of sound pollution in our homes like mixer, grinder, washing machines and motors etc. The first harmful effect of the sound pollution is loss of hearing. It also leads to several health related problems. Example, sleeplessness, hypertension, increase in blood pressure etc. 
so we have to take steps to minimize sound pollution okay next second one collect the photographs of different musical instruments and paste in your scrapbook so collect different type of instruments okay musical instruments and stick it okay next collect the photographs of local music musicians and exhibit them in your class okay collect some local musicians pictures like examples are given here you can see dr m s subbalakshmi she is famous in carnatic music gantasala venkateshwar rao playback singer okay and he is also a music director next vineet srinivasan famous malayalam playback singer come actor okay next kj they uh, sorry jay sudas great carnatic singer and music director and dilip kumar alias ar rehman music director come playback singer so you can stick your stick the pictures of your own okay not only these okay whatever you know you can stick it okay devi shri prasad music director come playback singer p sushila famous playback singer chitra she is also famous playback singer okay sri kannakudi vaidyanathan great nadis uh, nadaswaram vidwan okay he plays nadaswaram okay like this you can play uh, stick pictures of other people also other famous singers or music musicians okay any particular instrument musicians also you can paste the stickers okay that's all for today okay activities okay these are not necessary for you i think you can do it on your own okay by this we complete eighth class science okay sound lesson question answers in the next video we'll see the next lesson question answers till then bye kids have a nice day